to convert ratio into percentage. First, we will see the rule. How we need to convert the given ratio into percentage. Very simple thing. First, write the ratio as a fraction. So, any ratio is given. First, write the ratio as fraction. Okay, first we need to write the given ratio as fraction. So, A is to B means A by B. So, that will be not right. And then multiply the fraction by 100. and put this sign. So, percentage means compulsory percentage sign we need to keep. So, this is the rule. First, write the ratio as fraction and multiply the fraction by 100 and put the percentage symbol. That is Okay, A is to B is given. Now I can write, first you have to write uh, the ratio as fraction. That is A by B. Okay, then multiply the fraction by 100. Then multiply the fraction by 100 and put the sign. Okay, this sign you have to keep. So, percentage symbol. This if you simplify, then convert into the percentage. So I'll explain you examples now. So you just to for remember this rule. A is to be nothing but A by B into 100 percentage symbol you have to add. Convert So I'll take some ratios we need to convert into percentage ok 3 questions I will take 23 is to 40 and 143 is to 125 So these three questions I will convert into percentage now. So I am taking one mixed fraction. 6, 2 by 5 is to 8, 4 by 50. So let me see how we can convert into percentage now. So 23 is to 40 first. So according to the rule, first you have to convert into fraction multiplied by 100 and keep the percentage symbol so 23 by 40 so 23 is to 40 is ratio so 23 by 40 is the fraction so 23 by 40 that is equals to first you convert it now 23 by 40 into 100 just multiply it by 100 and keep the percentage symbol then you can go for cancellation. We can cancel 10 table, 10 fours are and 10 tens are 100. Internally, you can cancel. Again, 2 twos are 4 and 2 fives are. Okay, after cancellation, 23 into 5 by 2. So 23 into 5. 115 by 2 percentage. If you write, if you do division, that is a 57 and half. 
57 1 by 2 percentage 115 divided by 2 if you do division 57 1 by 2 percentage Okay, let me uh, explain the second one. 143 is to 125. So, first we need to write the given ratio into fraction. That is 125. Then apply the given rule. So, rule says 143 by 125 multiply by 100 and put the percentage symbol percentage sign. Now we need to calculate or cancel that is 100 and 125. I can cancel that 25 table. 25 fives and 25 fours are. If you practice cancellations it is easy to solve the problems. So 143 into 4. So if you multiply that is a 12 this is by 572 by 5 percentage so 572 divided by 5 it convert into mixed fraction 114 2 by 5 so you can check this 114 2 by 5 percentage Fine. okay see this uh, one more example. 6 2 by 5 is to 8 4 by 15. Individually, separately, you can convert into mixed fra improper fraction first. 5 6 is 30 plus 2. 32 by 5 is to 15 8 so 120 plus 4 124 by 15. Now given ratio convert into fraction. So directly I am writing 32 by 5 by 124 by 15. Okay, numerator is fraction and denominator also fraction. Now you can convert 32 by 5 is numerator. Denominator if you take up it reciprocal. So that is 15 by 124. Know this. Now you can cancel here. 5 ones are 5 threes are and 32 and 124 is a 4 table. 8 and 30 ones are 4 table I cancel. So finally 8 threes are 24 by 31. So after simplifying we got this. Now according to the rule, we just should multiply it by 100 and keep the percentage symbol. Okay. So just 24 into 100. So 2400 by 31 percentage. By just doing division, you can convert mixed fraction, you get the answer 77 13 by 31. So this is the conversion of ratios into the percentage. Now we will see how to convert percentage into decimal and decimal to percentage also now.